Days of Our Lives, Spoilers Thursday, October 3, Dr. Rolf's Phenomenon for Sarah, Eric's Plea to Holly, and Marlena Grills Brady. Kristen's Wild Discovery, Tate and Holly's Bifurcation, and Fiona Seeks Forgiveness. Greetings to all Days of Our Lives fans. Don't forget to subscribe for the latest updates. Rolf's Phenomenon for Sarah, Eric's Plea to Holly, and Marlena Grills Brady. Days of Our Lives spoilers for Thursday, October 3, reveal that Marlena Evans will pay Brady Black a visit at the Salem PD, where he'll voice enterprises about Kristen Dimmera's plan to get him off the hook. Marlena will worry that it involves commodity illegal, and it originally did since Kristen suggested making Sarah vanish or indeed blowing her up. Brady may admit he tried to talk Kristen out of going to Axes, but it's tough to make prognostications about how far she'll go in situations like this. Marlena will ultimately concentrate on the fact that Kristen remains hung up with Brady, so day spoilers say she'll quiz Brady about his moping passions for his partner. While Brady faces Marlena's grilling session, Maggie Kyriakis will advise Xander Kyriakis that he has to back off all the vengeance plots. Maybe Maggie will remind Xander of how much he has to lose and contend he can't risk going to captivity. Sarah Kyriakis and Victoria Kyriakis need Xander, so Maggie will supplicate him to stand down and avoid throwing away their beautiful life together. Next on Thursday's day's occasion, Eric Brady will make a plea of his own when he runs into Holly Jonas. Days of our lives suckers can anticipate Eric to defend Nicole Walker and push Holly to agree to see her. It sounds like Eric will prompt Holly to reconnect with Nicole on a trip to Paris, but Holly will struggle to get on board with the idea of talking effects out. In the meantime, Sophia Choi will comfort Tate Black following his bifurcation with Holly, which she obviously played a big part in instigating. Tate will let Sophia kiss him, so she'll feel good about making some progress. Indeed, if Tate eventually pumps the thickets since he's still dealing with all the Holly drama. Other days, spoilers say Kristen will view Dr. Wilhelm Rolf as exactly the person she needs to make commodity Big B for Brady. Kristen was just reflecting on how she couldn't save Brady without a phenomenon when Dr. Rolf surfaced from the Demira coverts. Luckily, Dr. Rolf has a knack for creating cautions, at least in his own way. Once Kristen seeks updates on Dr. Rolf's reasons for being at the house, she'll push for a favor. Kristen might request a miraculous cure for Sarah's palsy and hope that it'll be enough to move Sarah to change her statement. Days of our lives spoilers say Kristen will suppose Dr. Rolf is the ticket to getting Brady out of his legal jam, but there'll be some complicated news along the way. Days of our lives Wednesday, October 2 recap, Kristen's wild discovery, Tate and Holly's bifurcation, and Fiona seeks forgiveness. Days of our lives spoilers recap for Wednesday, October 2, reveals that Eric Brady stopped by Xander Kyriakis' office to charge him of hiring a gangster to medicine Brady Black. Eric suspected that Xander might have been conniving to wipe Brady off the chart and planned to prove he was over to no good. After Xander threw Eric out, he looked at the gun from his hole. Xander suggested the justice system had better work presto when it came to Brady or differently, he'd have to take matters into his own hands. At the Sound PD on Wednesday's day's occasion, Brady prayed Tate Black to believe he hadn't been drinking last night despite acting so out of it. Tate eventually said he believed Brady and vented to him about Holly Jonas, who snuck into Brady's room to meddle and had supposedly teamed up with EJ Demura. Brady allowed EJ was over to his usual manipulation tactics and prompted Tate to have compassion for Holly. In the city forecourt on Wednesday's days of our live show, Sophia Choi possessed Holly and pushed her buttons about playing teenage operative. Sophia also exulted about Tate passing in her and suggested that she'd be the one to satisfy him in bed soon. Holly smacked Sophia in the face right as Tate arrived and rushed to see if Sophia was okay. After Holly indicted Sophia of starting it, Sophia conceded that she indeed did but it was only because she was so worried about how Holly was treating Tate over his pater. Although Tate admitted Brady had prompted him to go readily on Holly, he decided he was done. Holly asked if that meant Tate was breaking up with her, 
but he didn't offer a clear response. Once Holly decided Tate was too important of a sissy to clarify effects, she said they were indeed over and suggested he be happy with Sophia rather. Holly angrily added that Sophia and Tate merited each other before stomping off. At the Dimmera Mance on Wednesday's day's occasion, Kristen Dimmera got updates on Sarah Kiriakis' statement being the reason EJ arrested Brady again. Kristen misdoubted that Sarah actually flashed back but EJ made it clear that Bray was going to do a lengthy stint in captivity. Once Kristen made her way to the Salem PD's interrogation room, she pledged to get Brady out of this mess. Kristen wanted to make Sarah vanish, so she considered transferring her back to the Demira Islet or indeed blowing her up. Brady shut down all that talk and pushed Kristen to accept that she couldn't save him from the slammer but Kristen refused to surrender. After Kristen left on Wednesday's day's occasion, EJ arrived to rub his palm in Brady's face. EJ made a vaticination that nothing could stop Brady from doing serious time at Statesville. Back at the Demira Mance, Kristen drank and had a frustrated converse with Stefano Demira's portrayal. Kristen knew nothing short of a phenomenon would save Brady, and suddenly, she was stunned as Dr. Wilhelm Rolf came out of the Demira cupboards. In the demand, Fiona Cook questioned Sarah about lying to the Bobbies. When Fiona said she knew Brady couldn't have been behind the wheel, she claimed it was because she overheard on Sarah and Xander's discussion. Sarah confessed that she had no choice but to give the police a bogus story since it was the only way to save Brady and indeed Xander. Fiona was frighted over Xander's fatal plot and said this was all her fault, but Sarah didn't understand. After Fiona criticized herself, she said perhaps she could have stopped Brady the night of the accident and taken him to an AA meeting if she'd seen the warning signs. Fiona hoped that Sarah could find it in her heart to forgive her. Sarah assured Fiona that none of this was her fault, but she also suggested they demanded to keep what they talked about earlier under wraps. Fiona said it'd be their little secret as Eric overhear hard and looked uneasy. Days of our lives, spoilers say Eric will keep searching for answers, so we'll keep you posted on his pursuit of the verity and any news he might uncover. Thanks for watching these videos. Please hit the subscribe button for more updated news.